Clock on the Stairs by Henry Wadsworth Longfellow Somewhat back from the village street stands an old-fashioned country seat. Across its antique portico, tall poplar trees their shadows throw, and from its station in the hall, an ancient timepiece says to all, forever, never. Never, forever. By day, its voice is low and light, but in the silent dead of night, distinct as a passing footsteps fall, its echoes along the vacant wall, along the ceiling, along the floor, and seems to say at each chamber door, forever, never never forever through days of sorrow and of mirth through days of death and days of birth through every swift vicissitude of changeful time unchanged it has stood and as if like god it all things saw it calmly repeats those words of awe Forever, never, never, forever. Fires up the chimney ward, the stranger feasted at his board. But, like the skeleton at the feast, that warning timepiece never ceased. Forever, never, never, forever. Their groups of merry children played, their youths and maidens dreaming strayed. O precious hours, O golden prime, and affluence of love and time. Even as a miser counts its gold, those hours the ancient timepiece told. Forever, never, never, forever. From that chamber, clothed in white, the bride came forth on her wedding night. There, in that silent room below, the dead lay in his shroud of snow. And in the hush that followed the prayer was heard the old clock on the stair. Forever, never, never, forever. All are scattered now and fled, some are married, some are dead. And when I ask with throbs of pain, ah, when shall they all meet again? As in the days long since gone by, the ancient timepiece makes reply, forever, never, never, forever. Never here, forever there, where all parting pain and care and death and time shall disappear forever there but never here the horologe of eternity saith this incessantly forever never never forever